I love managing at Bournemouth. That nine years or so at Bournemouth as manager was it was my first real manager, managerial job, and I loved every minute of it. You know, coming through the divisions, going there when they were in the old fourth division, into the third division, into the second division, and great lads, great player, you know, great characters. Um, we really, really had a great time. I think there, you know. Sorry, do you want to shut that door? Look, she's bark. She's got the bark. Once she starts barking, put the catch. I'll put the catch down. Do we'll keep her end. <laughs> oh no, she probably come out the other door now. Yeah. So that that was a great that was a great time for me at Bournemouth. You know, we winning promotion for the first time in hundred years of the club's history to get into the first division as it is now. Eddie Howe did it last year. He's the second second manager to do it. But that's in over 100 and odd years, so it, that was always special to me. And it was good fun, you know, managing at Bournemouth. We, you know, we, we used to train, we never had a training ground. We'd get thrown off the park. We'd train in Kings Park next to the ground. And the the, um, the old uh, park keeper would come round and throw us off. It was like being back at school in a way. Well, I used to live around the East End when we used to have the old porter come round and throw us off to a bit of grass around by the old flats we all used to live in. And we'd all have to shift off, and you know you, you, it was unbelievable. Professional football club, and the and the old park keepers throwing you off the bit of grass. But we had a great, great uh, sort of togetherness with me and all the players here, and we we were really successful, and it was a smashing time. Ron Atkinson, Ron was a manager. He was a good friend of mine now, you know, and. Uh, they came down, I mean, they were a team of internationals and we were a struggling third division team. And um, it was a major, they were cup holders and we beat them 2-0. You know, uh, Ian Thompson and Milton Graham scored the goals and it was just an amazing day, you know, to, to actually pull off a shot like that. But we all came back down to earth quickly on the Monday. On the Monday morning, we, we, went, we had a, a pitch there that was fenced in by the football ground and it was, it was sort of... Uh, Red grass, red oak, we call it whatever. It was that red shallow, shell sort of cinder stuff, you know. And we, the gate was open, so we all went in there, and we have a nice, so we having a nice nine aside on the Monday morning, all feeling top of the world. We just beat Man United, and the old park keeper come round on his bike, and put the padlock on, and locked us in. And it was about twenty foot high the fence, so we all had to climb over the fence to get out. I remember getting half, getting my leg over, and not being able to get my leg the other side, and. Oh, it was it was horrendous, but uh, he brought us back down to earth pretty quickly that day.